During normal flight, a quadrotor must produce forces and torques to accelerate and counteract gravity. It may also experience external forces and torques from physical interaction or external aerodynamic sources. We designed an algorithm to estimate these external forces and torques using only a first principles model of the quadrotor. We can use this algorithm to measure the forces and torques close to objects, such as the force due to wind in front of a fan, downwash below another quadrotor, and even the tiny aerodynamic forces close to a wall. We can use these force profiles to define actions for the quadrotor such as tracking the center of the wind induced by a fan, detecting downwash to avoid catastrophic loss of lift, and detecting the wall to avoid collisions, all by just measuring the external forces and torques on the quadrotor. Here, wind from the fan produces an aerodynamic force field. The quadrotor can use this force field to track the motion of the fan. Without downwash avoidance, the lower quadrotor cannot pass through the downwash of the quadrotor above it. With downwash avoidance, the quadrotor can detect the downwash and safely move to the other side. We can even use machine learning to detect the minute changes in aerodynamic forces close to a wall. Far from the wall, the quadrotor senses it is safe to move forward. Close to the wall, the quadrotor measures an aerodynamic force field. Wall detected! The quadrotor can now move back to safety. Wait a minute, who needs a fan when you've got summer students? Thanks for watching, and don't forget to check out our other cool videos and visit our website to learn more about our research.